welcome back to my channel way to merchant you guys once again hopefully you guys are doing well if you haven't subscribed my channel yet please go and subscribe my channel hit the bell icon press all to get notification for all my upcoming videos so welcome back to another new episode of maritime news it's a maritime news 5 so we'll cover all the news which has happened in the last week so let's move one by one four indonesian proof thrown to the sea so we'll move little further details and we'll see actually what happened one video went viral into the social media that dead bodies were being thrown to the sea from a chinese fishing vessel four bodies were thrown to the sea so south korean coast guard has been found these bodies and they have started the investigation till now no conclusion has been found so as soon as any report i get i'll definitely share with you guys so now moving to the number two news of the day so that is very good news that indian government permits the sign off by using the chartered plane for the indian seafarers so they have started sign off with the help of the chartered planes now in the third news it has been said by the many shipping companies that indian true chains are very expensive so I will make a video regarding that later on. Uh, this is a huge topic basically. Crew change in India is happening for more than two weeks. Shipping owners have shown great disappointment over being too expensive. As per the data released by them, it cost around 90k dollar to 180k US dollar for a crew change. So I don't know why shipping owners or the managers are telling them that in this scenario life is more important than the money so i don't know what is the reason behind it and it is a rumor that indians are expensive all around the world but i can show you i can prove you that indians are not that much expensive there are flaws in the operation and management that is why indians are known as most expensive crew in the world now another pirate attack will cover in this video that is tall apart a ship that is a product tanker IMO number 9719240 was attacked by the armed pirate in the near Yemen coast okay so it was a UK flag coast of Yemen armed pirate has been attacked two armed field ports Approach the vessel as security guards fired to warn them off. They opened fire on the ship and there are damages on the bridge area of the ship. Through minor, no injuries have been reported and the ship is on the scheduled as per planned. Number of privacy related incident has gone up in Gulf of Aden area definitely. Now I'll move to our next news that is seafarer index happiness. That seafarer's happiness index has been dropped drastically. So there is an index or you can see a rating has been given to the seafarers. So this has been dropped. So in the 2019 in the last quarter it was 6.39 out of 10 which has been dropped to the 6.30 out of 10 in the first quarter of the 2020. So seafarer has to fill 10 questions. It's like a psychometry only. So as per that ratings can be calculated and it can be given. So definitely due to this COVID-19 the happiness and the operation all has been affected that is why the index has been reduced drastically. now another good news that is the from the synergy maritime or synergy group philippines obviously not india so they have so they have posted vacancy so i can show you in the screen you can see all the details regarding the vacancy so you can pause the screen and find the details so another news that navy captain sacked after oil so what happened the commanding officer of Philippine Sea cruiser was fired from US Navy. Guided missile cruiser was taking fuel at Yorktown Naval Open Station and happened to have, happened to have 4,000 gallons of diesel fuel oil spill to the Virginia River. So the Navy captain was sacked due to this incident. Now still the investigation is going on. Now company, this is very funny news, I don't know that company asked seafarers to make mask from the torn bed sheets what the hell is wrong i don't know really i don't know see actually you can see in the screen the photos and all 
that uh, seafarers are making the mask from the bed sheets actually they need n95 masks which has to be provided by the shipping owners or shipping management companies but they have been asked to make masks from the bed sheets see everything cannot fabricate it right if you don't want to provide the real or the genuine spare for the part that is okay engineers are they are decked to or they are officers are there they can fabricate and somehow they can manage but what about the mask that is not safe that is a transparent clothing actually what does it mean a bed sheet is a transparent clothing you cannot make mask it is not certified that is why doctors have come up with certified mask that it can able to protect from the virus but a bed sheet cannot so i don't know really even the pp has been not supplied with some of the companies so that is horrible now next news is that china storing crude oil in bulk by importing through 117 vlcc ships china definitely they require crude oil so they have imported 117 vlcc for the crude oil they should remember this thing before spreading the covid 19 because they want the cargoes they are the one of the most sophisticated decorated countries in the whole world for that they want raw materials and for raw material supplying seafarers are playing their vital role you cannot deny that without seafarer raw materials or any oil or anything cannot be supplied to one country to another country and what china has done we all know now another thing thousands of seafarer sign global petition for cruise change i don't want to discuss little further regarding this everything is going on petition and all everything is going on day by day week by week but the outcome is zero ultimately so another reminder i would like to tell you that the synergy previous year question paper and study materials are available as well as the aspiring guy who are going to appear for the imu cet and any other company sponsorship examination such as anglo eastern great eastern and other companies that previous year sample paper also available so you can contact me in the details to get that okay so we move to another news that is a old news basically that filipino third officer went missing from the ticket anchors i have already covered this news one month back i think very time news one or number two episode i don't remember exactly so all seafarers are praying for this guy so the family also demanded for the proper investigation regarding this case incident so we'll see what conclusion we'll get another thing is that an open letter to all government by chief master so what is that we'll see in the details so you can see the letter i'm posting in the screen so you can read to the letter regarding ilo and all there has been written so you can see the letter in the screen only now another sad news is that 13 covid 19 positive cases has been again found means what happened it was migrated migrated in the sense suppose someone is having covid 19 and he has recovered from the covid afterwards again he was affected so that is very sad actually what i feel that it was not completely recovered or they have not maintained the instruction from the doctors which has to be followed after the recovery period there is a medical term also that after recovery period and we have to definitely take some restriction and regulations or anything you have to followed as per instruction from the doctor i think they have not maintained that that is why it has been found again so major cruise line about to shut their operation till 31st july see first thing is that the covid was spread from the cruise line only in the preliminary stage so because in the cruise line you cannot maintain social distancing first thing as much people are there the chances are higher so that is a good initiative i can feel that cruise line has been taken to shut their all the operation till 31st of july now filipino seafarers are claim that they are facing tough competition for the sea jobs i don't know why what i feel they are overtaking us <laughs> they are taking our place that is a huge debatable thing another video is required for that but they are claiming that russia china indonesian ukrainians are lots of seafarers coming for sea jobs and they are taking the place for the filipinos so that is horrible i don't know why i don't agree because they are replacing us day by day now two seafarers has been found positive in a hapagloid ship 
so it was the mv montepillar is a container ship has reported that it was arriving in durban south africa middle east india express service as per precaution of the ship everything has been taken but still two seafarers tested positive now next news explosion on tanker ship two crew member was injured so what is that due to an explosion chemical tanker injured two people an emergency treatment and care unit has been done so no fatality found but two guys were injured in the explosion now this is very heart breaking or maybe very sad news that is this is a quote and quote okay we too have families waiting for us crew members plead government for covid 19 test results so that is horrible they are actually literally pleading for the sign off now we are already come to the end three news are remaining so number 3 is that two member get seriously injured in a suicide attempt so as i have known that one crew member tried to jump from the 12th deck of the cruise ship and fell on the shipping container on a pier indonesian national who injured was on cruise ship vasco da gama so then medically he was treated but no fatality but critically injured now indian minister has been announced that aviation or the flight will start in from june or maybe july mid june or first quarter of the july the all flights will reach the optimum capacity and operation so the chances of sign up are really bright now chief officer resigns ship due to the no sign up this is the last news so you can see the letter which he has been sent to the company through the master that he want the resignation because there is no sign up so if someone is resigned i don't know what is the meaning of resignation if he is resign also sign up is not possible so better to stay and fight that is the thing definitely sign up will come companies are trying no one can deny the fact because they know that the operation which is going on in the shipping that is not fully safe because under a mental pressure under a family pressure no seafarer wants to work and no company allow the seafarer to work because it is a complete concentration job if, if you cannot concentrate on your job any incident or accident can happen at any time so i think i have covered all the news regarding this week news hopefully i'll come back to you guys in the next week with upcoming news which is going to happen in this week so thank you guys for watching the video and you have supported this segment my time news a lot that is why i am keep continuing this so keep support me like that like the video share with your friends don't forget to subscribe my channel hit the bell icon and press all to get notification for all my upcoming videos thank you so much guys for watching the video signing off for the day